Hey there, everybody. Fit here, and welcome back to Pinky's Got Stuck 1.0. We're doing it, lads. We're building our biggest, baddest composite alloy punishment center if you ever did see. We need to make more components, but once that's, once that's done, this is going to be heaven. You're going to love it. We also need some um, mechanical parts over here. Didn't I have some arms and legs lying around? That's a sentence. I got a couple of bionic arms. Actually, you know what? Let's just do this. This is an easier way to look through my inventory. See what I got going on right now as far as bionics. I need to get some sent over. Hmm. Got a couple of bionic arms. I don't need cybernetics or architect stuff for humans. I have an advanced bionic eye that does 150% extra efficiency. I did not mean to select it again. Compared to the regular one, which is 130. I also got this Cortex Augmentator, which is pretty good, but not the best. I might send Birch back to Ragamuffin City for surgery. That said, Cortex Augmentator is probably not the best thing. What do I want? Neurostim would remove hearing. Hypo Regulator is really good. Increases immunity gain, of course. Requires a Persona Core, which is interesting. Um, reduces mental break chance. Augmentator. Oh, this is probably still the best thing. Yeah, we already have one of those, so let's keep it. we got to upgrade these bionic arms. Just what something we need some more advanced components for. So that's what we're waiting for. We're waiting for these upgrades. How are we doing on advanced components? Anyone working on advanced components? Nope. Nobody at all is working on advanced components. Hmm. I guess the alternative would be... I mean, the alternative is to sell stuff and get advanced components that way. So I'm thinking what I'm going to do is grab every single one of these. Looks like we have more composite alloy done. Grab Senpai. Grab Sylvia. Grab some animals. Uh, these guys, at least. Wanted a Pepsi? You know what? We'll leave you behind then. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Sampai. And one more for Sylvia. Nope, you're not fully grown. Uh, <laughs> there we go. One for Sylvia. And then, can I fit Nikita in here? Yes, Okay. Bring all the gold and silver. Bring some masterwork clothing. We're going to drop you off right next to someone we can trade with. And our goal is basically to get as many advanced components as we can get. Eh, some of these weapons we definitely don't need. Uh, keep the legendary mace. That's tradition. Um... Yeah, but these swords can go, I think. Obviously, if it's only worth a couple hundred, it's probably not worth keeping at all. You know what? Let's get rid of some of these snipers as well. And the LMG. I don't need it. Keep these. You can always put them in someone later. Uh, these only weigh seven kilograms? It's less than I thought. What's this legendary jade sculpture? Dirk inscribing his name on a longsword. Ah, eh, we'll keep that. There's that vanimetric we're gonna send over. Mm, I think that's all we need to send. Probably. Are the voxels worth any money? No, they are literally worth nothing. Good to know. Eh. Obviously, bring some food for the trip. Load it up. Get ready for the biggest trades that ever did trade. We'll grab as many advanced components as we can, and we'll try to split them between the areas here. I'm trying to install a speed module. 
Oh, this is only going to be poor. Rip speed module, guys. It was fun while it lasted. Um, sure, let's see what this is. Clerk, what are you doing? Haul in composite alloy. No, you're hauling steel to a composite alloy thing. Move this instead. Oh, I don't have very much faith in myself. I don't have very much faith in this little digital version of me either. I feel like that's going to end poorly. This, I'm hoping, is going to end very well, though. Derek! What's wrong? The proposal was rejected by Vasilla. You're sharing a bed with someone who you don't particularly want to. Well, have you considered not? I'm not making you, dude. It's, look. Unassigned. Go get your own bed. Alright. That'll solve that problem. Look, it already bumped him down the miner. Moods are actually surprisingly okay over here, especially considering that high drone. I don't know if I approve of putting the speleopedes over here, but gotta do something with them, I guess. Actually, we should not put animal corpses over here at all. Yeah, don't put animal corpses over here anymore. Nope, that is Derek going back to major break risk. All right. Good to know. All right. Just for future reference, by the way, for those of you who might work in a, a place that does appointments, has some kind of appointment-based service, do me a favor. If... If you call someone to check in on an appointment they made past the appointment time and they call you back and say, hey, I already made that appointment. It's been completed. Go, oh, okay, cool. Don't transfer them three or four times to try to see who's the right person for them to talk to. What I'm trying to say is the companies should probably talk to each other every once in a while, you know person or group A talking to per group or person B. Something like that. Is this, yeah, is this an idea? I could be wrong. I probably am. Who knows? I don't run a company. I just, you know, work at one. So, I could always be wrong. I thought you were going to actually butcher this mechanoid, but no, you decided it was much more important to uh, clean up amniotic fluid. Which, I mean, very cool. I'm happy you did that, I guess. Especially since it probably means we have some new animal around here. Woo! 645 parts from that mammoth? Oh my lord, Dirk! What have you done? You gave us 32 components! I know he tends to, like, get extra stuff done, but, oh my god, I forgot. Dirk. Only Dirk does this. I forgot how stupid effective he is at some things. Alright, we're in a forest, so... In theory, you would think that would mean we would set up forest camo. But, honestly, the base camo probably looks the best for this area. Oh, snow camo is actually not looking that bad. Oh, I like it. And the woodland is okay. But I actually like the base with the composite alloy. I think that looks sweet as heck. Wait until we fire these bad boys. Ooh. Wait, were they... Yeah, I don't have to install the stuff in them because they're automatically installed, right? 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 I mean, yeah, yeah, that's... Yeah, we can fire all the way to Ragamuffin, so they're already installed. Awesome. 
In that case, get the rest of these set up. And then we're going to send Reynold and maybe Big Dog over to a different area. Just kind of see what happens, you know? Is there one of them that's relatively unpopulated? Well, uh, 11 enemies. Yeah, we'll, we'll send them to this outpost and see what happens. You know, once we have all four. It's going to be... I think it's going to be good. I think it's going to be on good. It's going to be nuts! Are there any more mechanoids to deal with? No. That's cool. No problem. Especially now we have 700 mechanoid parts. Good lord. It's like he individually turned them into parts. Alright, well, there's our third Punisher. This will also help research our ERS, which will help save power. We could also look at the ALC to decrease cooldown. Look at the MEPS, which boost maximum power in different ways. Hey, somehow our MEPS already is at 100% for weapons test. Dude, we might as well take advantage of that. This thing looks fun, too. One day I want to fire this. Anyway, let's actually start researching the maps. Whoop. Yeah. There you go. Initiated. This should be good. We're, we're, why are we missing power? Because I didn't build it. That makes sense. In fact, we should have power going all the way around here. Honestly. There we go. Get that done. And before I forget it, extend our camera down to here. There you go. Beautiful. So did I, was I successful in installing that thing? Oh no, the front shield window was shot out. That's not good. Yeah, I, I successfully installed the speed module. Cool. Hey, I'm not complaining. That's what I wanted to do. Cleaner bots. Go, go, gadget. Clean. Excellent. Now we can have this area all cleaned up. No longer looking like crap. Oh, we have more than enough ammo for all these. I could slap one more of these bad boys up here. But I don't know if I'm gonna... Actually, if I move this to the middle... I could slap another one of these bad boys here and here. To have a battery of six. And I might just be stupid enough to do it. Let's find out. Pinky, are you moving this thing? I think he is. He is! Yes. <laughs> Where in the hell are these mechanoids, man? I want to fight these dudes. Hopefully he'll be fully... Oh yeah, we could throw an artificial brain in him as well. So we could fully control him. We actually have everything but the Persona Core for that. Which is all good. Uh, how's this going? Loading in progress. Alright, nothing else needed here. Nothing here. Nothing here. Nothing here. Senpai needs to get in here. A little bit more silver. Senpai's not even riding the same one as Sylvia. But whatever. It's all good and fine and fine and good. Panther revenge. Well, that didn't work out too well for you, did it? Be careful. It's on fire. 
you done it. It was already partially pre-cooked. Whoa, Hydro, what's up with your mood? Darkness, soaking wet, uncomfortable. Whoa. Go fix it. Nice jacket, though. And pants. Pants are good, too. Yeah, I'm probably going to... Eventually, we'll get those upgrades done. Once we get more advanced components over in Ragamuffin City. And then we'll send Birch back to get those upgrades taken care of. All right. Head down to... Uh, slap us up right here. Probably the largest caravan, well, largest group of transport pods we've ever sent out at once. I could be wrong on that, but I think it is the biggest. Okay, they're getting filled up. Research actually coming down quite quickly. Transport pods have arrived. Visit Omar at the creek. You might actually make it there before you have to rest. Big dog, you are like insanely slow at construction, dude. Like, holy crap. Construction speed, 100%? Could have fooled me. By the way, two clones in the same room. <laughs> you may have noticed I went a while without saying anything. I had one of those sneezes. You know which one I'm talking about. The kind that just stays there and lingers for a couple minutes. And then when it finally happens... You feel like the bridge of your nose is going to explode. Um, anyway, two clones in the same room is pretty pretty nifty. And they're not even it's like a walled area more than a room. I think what is a room but a walled area with a roof on it. Pinky's already completely accepted his fate. And he loves his unbelievably impressive barrack. Finally! I was wondering when you boys would be here. What do we got? Three centipedes, six scythers, four assaulters. That's it. Yeah. Huh. Far more melee than I had thought. But all right. I need everybody. Get down here. They're hitting us from the southeast. We need to be ready. In particular, can I get one of you? I'll do it. Um, all right, me. On draft. Get that installed. Scythers aren't a big problem. The Salters will be. I think we can shoot down the Scythers before they get even close to being a threat. Uh, we made it to Omer at the Creek. Do they have advanced components, though? That's what's important. They have 10. All right. Well, I mean, it's better than none. I'll, I'm going to buy the regular components, too. And then I'm here to also sell. They have an artificial nose. Architect ear. Architect jaw. Hey, some skill books. Log book for intimacy. Increases intellectual. Increases intellectual. Increases mining. Indebted on annals. Huh? I also have a couple of persona cores, but I don't need those. Uh, let's sell. Especially since we need to take care of our mass here. Wait, why do I have the scope? Oh, that's, uh... That's Senpai's other weapon. Yeah, keeping that, definitely. Sell the clothing. I think we're gonna... Break even here. If I mean, if not, we definitely have the money for it, but... 
tuned. Nano suit helmets. Masterwork quality. Nice stuff, I'm not gonna lie. I could sell the gold, but I don't think I need to. Cleaner four. Cool. Yeah, we actually made money off of that. Um. Wow, the components weigh a lot. Okay. Hmm. Well, then you know what? Screw the components. Head down to the town of Cyrillus. Alright, everyone he needs to fire at will. Ray Ray, get in front. Remus, up front. Big Dog, up front. Pinky, behind. Since Pinky doesn't come with built-in protection. Alright, the shooting has begun. Birch over here rocking the double pistols. There we go. We need to make sure we are not outside of this thing. Wherever we end up deciding to stand. Alright. As long as the Scythers go down quickly, we'll be safe. God, Big Dog sh Shield is so good. Alright, these Salters are performing their namesake here. Go hide behind this tree. Don't want to give your help right now. Hydro, aim here. Scythers have some strong melee, so I want to make sure they don't get a chance to use it. It looks like... Where are you going? Alright, get him. Alright, team. Team melee, let's do it. All right, this guy's a problem. He's got an Inferno Cannon. Top one, not a big deal. What about this guy? He won't be a huge problem either. Where's the um, Flame Bot? Oh, he's dead. Never mind. Yep, that's what I'm worried about. Okay, Ray Ray's got the dodge. Uh, let's get back. So that the team can assist again. Yeah, we need more than just the melee boys doing stuff over here. Holy jeez! Dismiss with skill, return the incoming fire. Crushed the fourth body ring, killing the dang thing. Apparently that was an important body ring. Good lord. All right. Triple team this one. Done. All right. Okay. Uninstall this. Pinky, you're good to go. Everyone else, let's move you up slowly. Uh, never mind. Reynold single-handedly... Reynold hit the centipede with a hack from the longsword's edge, slashing its head in an explosion of gore. Knocked off a centipede's head in one hit. Actual legitimate madman. The most insane of boys. So we're not going to see mechanoids again for a while, probably. That said, we're going to break down these ones that we did just fight. Get some good parts from them. And find a way to make use of those. That was awesome. Actually, let's go ahead and reinstall this. Uh, you know what? Install it in the power room. So they can get its power. That makes more sense than uninstalling it, I think. Let's 
put it in the corner here. Okay. That was not too bad at all. Um, yeah. Allow messing with these guys. So there's no point in trying to set off all their emergency signals because the mechanoids are going to be suspicious of us. So I guess we just leave leave it as is, right? Kind of see what happens from there. I think that's about all we can do. We got 24 days before we can go get some more advanced components. So yeah, right now everyone's just going to relax, enjoy that victory. We're going to relax until we can build the rest of these uh, punishers. We need eight more components. So basically, we just need Dirk to uh, clean up a little bit. Sorry, let him play some billiards, though. Let the man have his fun. Hydro, you also need to have some fun, although you're working on it right now. Oh, actually, his mood's going to go way up. You probably have nothing to worry about there. I am unable to fully feel emotion. Well, you arguably still have it better than Terillium. Although Terillium is using the punching bag right now. I want to see if he actually gets skill from it. Dude needs food. Like, kind of badly. I don't see him punching it. If he does get skill from it, it goes very slowly. Kirk was very quick to go from playing billiards to relaxing socially. He's going to lose the catharsis in 18 hours. Could be bad. All right, but right now his recreation is still going up. He's almost got it up to the next point. So let him do that. And then when he's done doing that, disassemble mechanoids. Yeah, go get some food. Don't watch TV. Eat. Excuse me, but uh, maybe you need to eat some fruit. What, does the fruit give you a bad thought? Do you not like dried fruit? Is that the kind of person you are? Talk to me here. It's actually a good way to test out moods without actually affecting him. No, it's extremely impressive dining room. Unbelievably impressive rec room. No word about liking or disliking the food, so it was perfectly adequate. I don't know why it took him so long to do it, but okay. That's cool, I guess. Let's go rip apart a Scyther. See what its innards look like. And maybe we can rip them all apart. Put them back together. It'd be great. Then we can infuse children's souls in them. Or, that's, that's a different game. Uh, 11 components from that and 132 mechanoid parts. Not bad at all. How many mechanoid parts can we store here? Okay, 6,000. Yeah, we got... Got a little bit of space. A little bit of extra space. I like how we have gold and silver just sitting out <laughs> on the outside of our base. Like they're the least important things that our entire base has. They're called priorities, sucker. We got them. We know what they are. And we're perfectly okay with how we have them set. Katie snagged some trash while fishing. Katie got wood, you could even say. Oh, he's, they're resting here. They don't have any bed rolls, so they're sleeping, I guess, in the street. I mean, I love this build-up of components and advanced mechanoid chips. It's honestly a little insane. I would assume crafting. There you go, me mechanoid disassembly efficiency. 1,154. That's why he gets so much stuff out of them. He literally breaks them down. 
to every single component part and finds a way to make every single part usable. 35 components like nothing. My dude. How many components can we fit here? Now that we'll ever get to the capacity. 4,000. If we get to 4,000 components, we've officially run one RimWorld. I think that's... I think that's the rule. That's how it works. Are you actually dead? Oh yeah, we cut your head off. And by we, I mean Reynold. In one hit. Oh. All these others took like a dozen shots. Well, this one was actually like... Dismas just went blam, 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 I think. Dismas, 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 Dismas. Yeah. We made it look a little easy. I mean, I'm loving this whole disassembly thing. That said, that is going to be it for this episode of That Plays RimWorld 1.0. If you enjoyed it, make sure to let me know by giving a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more. It's going to keep coming. Won't stop coming. Thankfully, Kovac's mood is going to go up. We're going to finish off with these Punishers. We're going to get them fully loaded, locked, and stocked. Uh, probably going to have to install this in them eventually, but... Then we're going to test them out. We're going to test them out on this poor bastard right here. Yeah. If you want to see it happen, make sure to subscribe to see more. And thanks again for watching That Plays RimWorld 1.0. I will see you in the next video.